Hello and welcome to Mile High Reefers. I'm Scott Anderson, and this is just a quick one-take update video. Basically, my wife's just had surgery, and I haven't had time for the tank or for videos. So I'm just going to shoot a couple minute video, just one shot, talking behind the camera, and kind of let you know how things are going. So first, the tangs are doing pretty well. There's been a little aggression between the two yellow tangs and the, or sorry, the two purple tangs and the yellow tang. Nothing to get too worried about, but there's a little bit of aggression there. Not too much though. The bigger issues that are currently going on are, as you saw last time, I was getting a little bit of recession on my Monty's. Well, that's gotten worse on this guy. The green Monty is doing better. And this guy is fading in color. Now, one of my subscribers suggested that maybe I had too many bio pellets. And I'm thinking maybe they're right. So I've taken out three cores of my bio pellets and we'll watch how that's going. The idea being that I was stripping all the nutrients out of the water and just leaving nothing for the corals. Now, nothing happens fast in the reef tank. So I did this about three, four days ago. And it, it's about the same. But I'm not expecting a lot right now, right? But I have eight tangs, so nitrates should build pretty quickly when given a chance in here. The other thing that's happened was my Jibo pump has finally completely quit working. Uh, a little while back, if you remember, I said it was stopping, so I was going to soak it in vinegar. I did. It didn't fix it. So I tried muriatic acid, and that cleaned the housing really well, but destroyed the impeller. Well, it didn't destroy the impeller, but it took all the glue off of it, and then I found some big cracks in the plastic. So I ordered a new one of those on Amazon. We'll see what that turns out like. And since the water flow is messed up, my Euphelia garden looks like crap. They're getting water flow in places they're not used to having it. Weird laminar flow going over. They're not happy. Same with the Senulera and the Toadstool leather. So, yeah, it's, it's been a little rough over here lately. Nothing major, nothing real bad to speak of, but just lots of stupid little stuff. So anyways, I thought I'd get a quick video out there since this is probably all I'm going to get to this week. Let you guys know how everything is going on the tank, and I'll see you on the next one. So, thanks for watching.